This is MK, a musical theatre artist extraordinaire. He was born in Durban and raised in Umlazi. He went to Four Ways High School. His passion for singing began in 2007 at the age of 16 when he had his first performance. It all began when he auditioned for his school musical West Side Story and got cast into the Sharks Ensemble. I'm Yami, a performance and musical theatre student. MK and I are close friends and we both do the same musical theatre class. MK had the opportunity of a lifetime. He got cast in Dreamgirls, the stage musical. But instead of taking it, he decided to stay in school. As a close friend, film student and artist, I don't understand why he didn't take it. If I was given the opportunity to work on a feature film while still in school, would I take it? There's only this given to love or live in fear. No other road, no other way, no day but today. <clears throat> Hi, everybody. My name is MK. And that is my name. <laughs> uh, my name is Dombenle. I was born sh from Shangase family and I got married to Kanyile. And then MK is my third child. Oh, I just think music is in his body. I think there's certain people that you watch and you, there's just a, a intuitive connection to music and I, like when I watch MK and he's like connected and his head isn't taking over and the demons when he's <laughs> when he's just doing what he does which has happened in the last two months the music that is inside him just permeates his work why am I still at Vits? sure I ask myself every day it's my dad it's my dad I don't wanna I have a terrible fear of disappointing people, like I said earlier. It's intense, like I don't... People have expectations and you have to negotiate with them as well. It's like your expectations, I can only fulfill them up to this point, you know. But I mean, finishing school is something I want to do as well, as intense as it is, you know. I mean, I'm repeating drama and film and it's going to be hard next year to write a 10,000 word essay, you know, but I have to finish, you know. I have to make people proud of myself. What's more important, don't stop working, shop, override, it's never too late. Look at this, what's that? School uniform. Where'd you go? Four ways high school. Half colors for volleyball in grade nine, and then full colors for drama um, 
in grade 11 or grade 12 no grade 12 i got full colors for drama and then this white stripe means that i'm in matric so every single matric had the white this is day an up-and-coming fashionista and mk's boyfriend who had more to say about mk and the challenging life of an artist he's funny understanding he's very um he does get impatient he's like I, was, I think he's impatient. He always wants to be perfect, like now. Um, he doesn't, I don't think he gives himself enough credit for what he does. He's very, he's, he's, very, he's very passionate, he's passionate. Yeah, he's very passionate about everything he does. I think that's one word that runs him up. It's hard to find a star, but it's harder to find stardom. So what you up to, buddy? I am writing a drum part. Because we're recording tomorrow, man. We're recording drums Sunday. Um, MK is... MK is a person who likes truth and honesty and um, love. And I'm constantly trying to find the right thing at all times. And it's hard can't be right all the time. But I think that's my one thing. I just try and be right all the time. MK mentioned that one of his role models is Lois Obala. We searched for this star, hoping to give MK the chance to meet him and to pick his brain about being an established artist and the music industry. This is his house. So guys, what are, what are we gonna say when we get to the gate? What are we gonna say? We gotta get our story straight because this we is his house. We are from a we are from a charity organization. Right. Our attempt to find Loiso Bala was unsuccessful. This failure inspired us to question the risk of failing at our own chosen careers. You could just copy the other one over here. I could. We can record it. That's cool. Okay. Do you know who we are? Yeah. Cool. Conflict comes from the question of what if you don't make it. Studying for four years and you don't make it in the real world. Was it worth it? Uh, I, I used to be so hopeless at studio. Um, I've used MK twice for corporate work mm. and he's um, very professional. He knows his work very quickly. But more importantly, he's very talented. Uh, so you think he has a future in this industry? Very definitely. If he carries on working hard, focusing, and maintaining his craft, he's, there's no reason why MK should not make it as a musical theatre performer in this country. Okay. I know, but I'm having some hopes that uh, he sometimes finds some job that he has to perform, so that, ge that gives me hope that he will like stand on his two feet when he's through with his studies. That's my fear, is that he won't get what he wants to get, you know? And it really, it, it does, I think about it all the time. It, it's like, oh, because I know it's a very tough industry that he's in, very, very tough. So my faith is that he won't, he won't get what he, what, what he wants and to be the person who he's working so hard to be, that it won't happen and, at the, and that it would take longer than he is expecting. Pride, I think. Um, I don't want to be that person like at family functions and like mm. five years later, mm. there's MK checking out groceries. So I think uh, family expectations as well because I remember two of my cousins tried to do a little singing duet thingy my bob and it failed miserably. But obviously they didn't study. They were just like, yo, let's do this, quite or star, whatever. And it failed, so I don't want to be them. The road to success is never easy, and there's no guarantee of making it. But the alternative is living a life that does not fulfill your passion on this earth. And that is the real failure. We've found that this search for stardom is tough. It's hard. But we've also found that the passion that an artist has for his art is enough to keep him going. As artists, we know what we want, like any other human being. We're all embarking on a journey, and there's no certainty on how that journey may turn out. 
but that is not enough reason to not go on the journey at all. There will be challenges, fears, and anxieties. The chance of success comes with the risk of failure. Which path will your journey take? The chance of winning or the risk of losing? That's all you get. Yeah, it's just to be himself and don't try to please other people in whatever way and just to pursue his dreams. I do, I do think he's going to succeed. I think he's going to be a brilliant musical composer. Mm. Yeah, I think, I think I have one foot in the door and it's, 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 it's a waiting game, more a writing game, drum and phone, to get out of here and put my other foot in the industry. And yeah, I'm not afraid.